<laughs> At last, Mondstadt's rodent ruler in the flesh. Scurrying through the streets, looking for leftovers? Mondstadt calls this a god? Resident rodent beats invasive vermin! Don't you dare speak back to me, insolent bard. Absentee Archon of Mondstadt. How impotent you've become. That smirk you wear looks out of place. Did you steal it from your master's face? Should have held your tongue. So, this is a gnosis. Wouldn't huh? be caught dead wearing this ugly thing in public. Beauty is a waste when the beholder has no taste. <laughs> Benty! <laughs> well, we have what we came here for. Come, before our dear Favonian friends arrive. Leave nothing for them to find. Your swordsmanship is quite impressive. But that's about as far as you'll get. <laughs> Didn't think you had that card hidden up your sleeve. You were just playing with Oh, quiet down. Stop acting like some wide-eyed recruit. You've seen this world. You of all people should know. This should have been expected. <laughs> well then, I'll be taking Morax's Gnosis now. Huh? <laughs> I see. Well, this is most unexpected. You... You beat me to it, didn't you? <laughs> Interesting. Mind if I join you? What ho? We meet again, Vagrant of Inazuma. <laughs> My retinue and I were just... The first time the Millilith were present, I had to forego the chance to strike down Mondstadt's savior. This time was a perfect moment. I was mere seconds away. Who was that mage? She could not have known who I am. Perhaps her powers are real to her things unseen. Soldiers! Sir! Sir! Find them, and when you do... Another one? My lord! <sighs> it's happening again. This is the largest one we've seen so far. They just keep coming, but so be it. Move out, change a plan. Your prior objective remains in force. Continue to research the meteorites. My lord, leave them to us. We will make short work of them. 
Are you deaf or just stupid? When did I give you the right to issue your own orders? My, my apologies, my lord. Now move out and complete your objectives as assigned. triumphant hero returns at last. And to a rather spectacular welcome, even if I do say so myself. You're the outcast, expelled from the academia. Indeed I am. Although these days they tend to call me the Doctor. <laughs> if you're looking for your researcher friend, she has already been taken into confinement. With some basic caution, she could have discovered the listening device on her person. Clearly, she lacks the degree of rigor expected of a true scholar. <sighs> the people of Samir City! What have you done to them? I simply made some minor adjustments to their Akasha terminals. Now they can deposit information directly into the subconscious. As you can see, all these lovely people now believe this traveler is a hero who has just saved the world. <laughs> My experiment is a success. And now it seems they can no longer hold back their sheer adoration. Oh no! What should we do? These are all just regular people! Leave now. You need to get out of here. What? That guy's a Fatui Harbinger! We can't just leave you here! Nor can I abandon the people of Samaru! You appear to have overridden their mental faculties with your own consciousness. To possess such a powerful mind, you must be the God of Wisdom. 